Good morning, church. I'm sure you enjoy that powerful charge sermon. My name is Annie Baseo of the Sunday School Department here at this parish. Your Sundays are never complete without Sunday School. I encourage and implore you to wait behind after the first service for the Sunday School. You're welcome to this parish, which is the Rose of Sharon of the Redeemed Christian Church of God. If today is your first time worshiping with us, I kindly ask that you wait after the service so that our hospitality team can wait on you. May God smile on you and overwhelm you and may his grace favor you this week and always in Jesus name. Guess what guys, um, next Sunday will be a combined service and we will be coming in a beautiful, colorful, um, traditional African wear. And why? Because it's going to be an African praise worship service. Please invite everyone and ensure that they come because we know you will certainly encounter God on that day. The service will commence at 7.45 a.m. Obviously, fresh anointing for ministers and workers will hold at 7.15 a.m. The Evangelism Department embarks on outreach from 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. on the second and last Saturdays of the month. Members are encouraged to join the department for these outreach. The takeoff point is the RS ground. However, please note that Evangelism on the second Saturday in August will not hold because of the annual convention. We meet physically on Tuesdays for Digging Deep service, while Thursday services, the Faith Clinic, will continue to hold virtually until otherwise announced. Time for the midweek services remains 6.30 p.m. prompt. This Tuesday, 2nd of August, at Digging Deep will feature a communion service starting at 6.30 p.m. prompt. The venue remains ROS main auditorium. Marriage counseling classes have begun and it's held at the conference room in pastor's office. This happens immediately after Sunday school on Sundays. The family unit, which is a subunit of the marriage counseling department, has commenced operations. Do you seek counsel regarding nagging family issues? If so, kindly see the administrator at the church office and he will surely refer you to a counselor. All our counseling sessions are highly confidential and we have trained counselors to attend to your needs. We encourage you to visit the Rose of Sharon Bookshop to see an array of life-transforming Christian business and leadership resources. The Open Heavens Devotional, Sunday School Manuals, and House Fellowship Manuals are also available for sale at the bookshop. The church desires to have house fellowship centers within GRA Keja and the Air Force Base. Are you led to receive the Ark of God into your home? If so, Kindly leave your name, address, and phone number at the church office, and we will contact you accordingly. We ask that you kindly send your prayer request to rccgrsprayers at gmail.com, and we will join you in prayers. We will forever proclaim God's faithfulness. He preserved us and our loved ones throughout the pandemic. And as we move past this dreadful era, we encourage all to continually practice proper hygiene and to always keep our hands clean. Teach our children to follow us in the hygiene culture. Shalom. We encourage our youth and other members of ROS to make the best of the opportunity provided through our CSR Center initiative. Courses offered include fashion designing, hairdressing, catering, makeup, gilet tying, and digital marketing. Registration is free, but tuition costs 10,000 Naira only. You can pick your registration form at the new ROS CSR Center, which is situated at number 49B Ladi for Batea Street. It is a street behind the church. The CSR Center is open from 8.30 a.m. to 3 p.m. every other workday of the week, except Wednesdays. Do not miss this incredible opportunity. Non-members are also welcome to benefit from the courses. A city that prays continues to triumph. For over 40 years and counting, the joy of the Lord is strong. 
Have you seen a prayer ground? A place for hymns? A place of praise? And so much more! Now you don't want to miss the annual convention of the Redeemed Christian Church of God starting on the 8th to 13th of August 2022. The theme is Perfect Jubilee. Venue is Kilometer 46 Lagos Ibado Expressway, Ubu State, Nigeria. Ministering is Pastor E.A. Adeboye and other anointed ministers of God. This is a different one and meant for you in particular because we are jubilating. We encourage all to make adequate plans to be part of the convention as we are convinced that it shall be the best convention we have witnessed thus far. Ministering is Pastor Ie Adebe and other anointed ministers of God. Let us spread the information widely. The Solemn Assembly for Ministers will hold at the Redemption Camp from August 4th to August 8th, 2022. It is a prelude to the annual convention. We encourage all ministers to attend. The Arras Wisdom Group will be hosting all elders, that is members who are aged 50 years and above, within the province here in ROS today. We encourage all Arras members who are 50 years and above to attend the program, especially because we are the host. Venue is Arras Youth Church and time is 2 p.m. prompt. Even if you look young, or you're over 50, please attend. A new baptismal class will commence soon. Interested members should kindly visit the church office to pick a registration form. I discovered that people were after miracles. Those who were following me then, they wanted miracles, but they didn't want a miracle worker. If you're coming to church, come and serve God. Seek ye first the kingdom of God. Is that not so sad? When somebody has been coming and looking unto Jesus, I mean, fasting, praying, and everything, if after whatever God now gives him, whatever, he will appreciate it and he will not leave God. But somebody is coming for the first time, he's at the door, receive your miracles, and maybe the next day he receives double promotion. If you go back to him, sir, we didn't see you in church last week, say, which church? I don't need church, man. I trust God. It doesn't take God a second to reverse the irreversible. It doesn't take God a second to remove anybody. You get it? If you don't get it, then forget about it. Yesterday, Saturday, the 30th of July, was a July edition of the Hour of Healing Prayer Program, a program where Pastor Kalejai ministers. It was an awesome program. I look forward to hearing you share your testimonies next Sunday. No church is complete without the teens, and uh, we want to congratulate our teens who had a three-day fantastic program titled Teens Camp Out. And the, the thematic focus was upgrade. We know that everyone needs an upgrade, even our teens, particularly in these days of conflicting news and report. We must encourage our teenagers at home to upgrade themselves in the Word of God daily. God bless you, and well done. Teens Church. I thank you as you listen to the various updates shared. We know we are in perilous times and times are hard, but the Word of God speaks in the counter spirit. I encourage you all to admonish one another to share the Word and live out the Word as you continue in this week. But most importantly, you must try and attend Sunday school. God bless you. My name is Ani Basi Eyo. Have a blessed week.